It has been revealed that fraud was used in the registration of the National Judicial and Allied Workers Union and Sprinter Union within the judiciary. One of the court marshals involved in the registration of the said union has told the Industrial Relations Court that this union was registered with an element of fraud. Two of the said members who were proof of evidence to warrant the registration of the said union by the Labour Commissioner Chanda Kazia were said to have been fraudulently listed on that particular document. 53-year-old Inok Mwape testified that forgery was used to have the union registered by the Labour Commissioner. To this end, the Judicial and Allied Workers Union wants the court to declare that the registration of the Save Sprinter Union is now void as fraud was used. Judicial and Allied Workers Union General Secretary Vincent Makonto also testified that despite telling the Commissioner Kazia of the forgery, he did not cancel the registration certificate, but advised the cases of forgery be reported to the police. It is the lack of action on the part of Kazia that has forced the Judicial and Allied Workers Union to take the matter to court. While as this is the case, the Zambia Police Service is said to have thoroughly investigated this case and arrested two people in connection with the said registration of the Judiciary Union Sprinter Group. To this end, the two suspects already charged with forgery and uttering of false documents have not appeared in court despite having been arrested in May 2018. The said criminal matter has not taken off before the Lusaka Magistrate Court, while as a civil matter in this case, the one before the Industrial Relations Court gives confession by one of the court marshals used in the registration of the said Sprinter Union to the effect that there is fraud in this registration. Mwat Pekwenda, Prime TV News, Lusaka.